All right, guys, Jack here today. Today we're going to do a little training on how to uh, navigate the GoDaddy control panel. Usually, the first thing you do is click on where it says my account right there and go ahead and log in. Let's see here, guys. Let me just go ahead and log in real quick here. I wanted to show you this as I log in that way. Uh, you know what? Hold on one second here. That way you can see it from the beginning because it gets kind of confusing in here. So, oops, wrong number. Hopefully, uh, hopefully it'll make it. Oh darn it! Hold on, let me put this password in here one more time here. GoDaddy requires that you have a uh, long password. So what it'll do is it'll kind of act like it didn't log in. But then it'll come if you come right here on the right on the green bar right here on the top, it'll say your name right there if you're already in. And then what you'll do is you'll just go you can click right here where it says visit my account. And once you click into that part right there, uh, usually what you'll do is you'll go with your root domain is what the, is what your uh, account will be set up on. And mine it is jackandkaren.org. So I would just click on web hosting. And then I'll click on this little green button right here. It says launch. And once you do that, you'll be into the guts of the control panel. Now, as you as you will see right here, this little window loading right here is a uh, is actually WordPress, and I have that on jackandkaren.org. As you can see right here, applications, WordPress, databases three, hosted domains three. But that's not, that's not what we're looking at. Anyways, what so what you do is you go over here and go to the files FTP file manager click on that and then that brings you to the file manager and you can see all your files so basically what we'll do here is we'll go ahead and go ahead and cut that close that out uh, as you can see here I have a whole bunch of files in here now uh, what happens inside of here is that where it says web root that's where your WordPress is as you can see down here where it says WordPress admin, WordPress content, WordPress includes. All those right there are the three files that are that are the root to jackandkaren.org. And if you want to uh, uh, edit in any of the other files, like here's my other domain, jackandkaren.info. So I'll just click on that. And as you can see right here, here's the index of the site. So basically any file structure goes jackandkaren.info and index right there will show up on jackandkaren.info anyways guys that's about enough of that training and I uh, uh, hope to see you on the next training and if that helped share with your friends on Facebook and Twitter and that's all I got jack out